Good morning again. I got something else interesting here. This is that tank that uh, I've been using the Nopox on. <clears throat> so the nitrates and phosphates are, are zero, <clears throat> excuse me, on my test kits. And one of the interesting things that's happening in here is that the green algae inside the tank is completely gone. And what replaced it is this red turf algae, which is not quite as ugly, but it's still algae. And I just find that fascinating. I think marine algae in general is fascinating. There's like thousands of different species. You, and you try to look this species up and it's, you know, there's, there's too many to, to, to choose from. So I've always just called it red turf algae. But anyway, now it's growing like gangbusters. And the same thing is happening down here in this refugium. I don't know what you call this thing. A, a place that grows algae. But the, the green algae is slowly dying. And the red algae is starting to grow. So I asked my biologist wife what she thinks about that. And she said, obviously, the, green, the red algae needs less nutrients than the green algae. <laughs> so uh, that was very helpful. Anyway. I just think that's amazing, and I don't know what to make of it, but the zero nutrients is not having an impact on this red algae. It's growing like mad. All right, see you later.